The following video will demonstrate how to configure the sample setting parameters in the Solar line of particle counters from Lighthouse Worldwide Solutions. Let's get started. From the main screen, press the configuration button located on the bottom section of the screen. This will take you into the instrument configuration screen. Now press the settings button, which is the button that looks like a folder with papers going into it. You will see two sets of buttons, mode buttons and format buttons. There are four buttons in the mode section. They are auto, manual, beep, and concentration. When the instrument is in auto mode, it will start counting particles automatically according to the sample time, hold time, and the number of cycles that are configured. If cycles are set to zero, the instrument will continue indefinitely until the stop button is pressed. When the instrument is in manual mode, it will start counting and stop at the end of a program sample time. When the instrument is in concentration mode, it gives a calculated value of the concentration of particles in a volume of air. Either counts per cubic foot or per cubic meter. Sample time for concentration mode is automatically set to six seconds. When the instrument is in beep mode, the instrument is pre-configured to beep according to the alarm threshold set in the alarm configuration. The instrument will beep each time an alarm threshold is reached and then every multiple of the alarm limit. Select the mode of operation you want to use and move to the next set of buttons. In the format section of buttons, you will find six different buttons. They are differential, cumulative, raw, normalized, cubic feet, and cubic meters. Data on the instrument can be displayed in differential mode or cumulative counts. Select how you want the data to be displayed on the main screen and move to the next set of buttons. The data format is either raw or normalized. Raw data displays the actual number of particles counted. Normalized data shows particle concentrations calculated from the raw data based on the settings chosen, either cubic feet or cubic meters. Select how you want the data to be displayed on the main screen and move to the next set of buttons. The final selection you will need to make is to choose whether you want the data to show up as particles per cubic foot or per cubic meter. Select how you want the data to be displayed on the main screen. You have now completed your selection options in the settings section. Now press the back button to return to the configuration screen or press the main button to return to the main screen. That concludes the training on configuration setting functions for the solar line of particle counters from Lighthouse Worldwide Solutions. For more information on Lighthouse products, go to www.golighthouse.com.